Hi guys, welcome back to the channel again and I am back with another video. So today in this video, we will build something amazing and fun. And as a YouTuber, I always wanted to build a live YouTube subscriber counter. But then I thought why just stop there? Let's add numbers of views and numbers of videos as well. So today we will build our live YouTube subscriber counter based on ESP8266 and ST7735 display module which will display number of views and number of videos along with the subscriber count on our channel. So guys without wasting any more further time let's do this. <laughs> So guys this video is brought to you by Next PCB a high quality professional PCB manufacturer you can get PCBs from Next PCB for $0 with $0 shipping fee and for returning customer it is $2 for 2 layer PCB $6 for 4 layer PCB and get free shipping on PCB assembly service well wait there is more next PCB is having an amazing Christmas lucky draw in which you can win a my smart band a free PCB prototype a $5 coupon and many more other prizes and you can get coupons up to worth $3,000 and you can get huge discounts on PCBs as well these offers are available till December 31 so the link is in description so go to the link and participate in the lucky draw and win amazing prizes now guys let's get back to our project so guys since we are planning to get subscriber count and some other data from youtube so obviously we'll need a esp and then we need a display to display the data so to decrease the cost of the project we'll be using node mcu board and for the display I am going with this ST7735 display module. Now since we need to fetch data from YouTube so for that we actually need an API token and to get the API token you have to log in to developers.google.com and make sure to log in with the same ID which is associated with your channel then after logging in go to console.developers.google.com then here click on create project after creation click on enable API and services then here search for YouTube and select YouTube data API version 3 then make sure you have enabled this API and then click on manage and then in API overview page you can click on credentials then in here click on create credentials and select API key and you will get the api key for your account now we got the api key so let's go to pc so in there first you have to make sure you have installed esp8266 boards in your arduino ide then you have to make sure that you have installed youtube api library and after that make sure you have installed the st7735 libraries for the display and if all these steps are done then download my code from video description and then in my code please input your Wi-Fi details then enter the API key which we just retrieved and last but not the least we need a channel ID so for that go to your YouTube channel and get your channel ID and paste it here and you are pretty much done then connect your board to PC and just upload your code and after uploading the code you can just refer my shown schematics and connect everything according to it or you can download my Gerber from description and you can use my Gerber to order free PCBs from next PCB website and after getting your PCBs you can connect everything together and then you can power the board and if we did everything correct then it will load our channel details which would be basically number of subscribers number of views and number of videos 
and guys this data won't be 100% real time so if you have a lot of views or subscribers let it have a small percentage error so guys i hope you like this video and if you do hit like give me a share and do subscribe because soon i'll be making a better version of it and don't forget to put down your thoughts in comment section so guys that's pretty much it for today let me know your thoughts and i will see you guys in another video till then stay safe and keep exploring